At 16, I broke up with my girlfriend and the reason was that she cheated on me. It wasn't that bad, but at the time it was big for me. Now, with this, I tried to act really chill, really relaxed. And, you know, I was pretending like it wasn't a big deal to me. That I, I could just deal with the situation, we could talk about it calmly right away. That was completely false. The reason it was completely false is because I was suppressing these feelings. I really was super affected because it had come out of nowhere. And does this make sense to you, right? If you push down feelings, are they still in you or are they out there? Well, they're still in you. So they were still in me. And what happened was that we would get on FaceTime to talk about whatever or about the situation. I think we actually just tried to move on. And um, I would randomly erupt and like, yell at her on FaceTime, right? And it, I think it probably made her a little bit nervous, a little bit uncomfortable, a little bit scared. She wasn't expecting me to do that. And neither was I. It would be so out of nowhere. And right here, this is probably how abusive relationships start as adults. Not that I know really much about like that kind of stuff, but you know, people not being able to communicate their emotions, right? And the reason they probably can't communicate their emotions is probably because they they're affected by some issue, right? And they don't take the time to go deal with that. They don't go to take the time to actually just acknowledge that it's fucked and are just like feeling it. So your body can process that shit and then fucking push the excess negative energy out. And people, people may not do that. And then they, they, they hurt those around them in whatever way that is. So... Whenever you get negatively affected by anything, please go away, go cry in your room, go feel the feelings. Do not try and pretend like stuff isn't affecting you. If it's affecting you, it's affecting you. There's nothing, you can, there's just, what do you do? Just fix the problem by feeling the emotions. So that was exactly why I'm so glad that I, I learned that lesson at like age fucking 16 not to suppress your emotions because you can you can do harm to those around you if you if you don't so once you've processed your shit you can come back to people awesome thanks for watching appreciate it I've got a community or at least an email community in the description Peaky Pines community join it and have a cheeky day. Do it. And do a cheeky sway.